Look, I'm trying to set the mood with the candle. Are you feeling very romantic and sexy? No? Okay, that's good. Yeah. Hey guys, I want to ask you guys, is there something that bothers you specifically, but doesn't really bother other people? It just stands out to you, and when you see it, or hear it, or feel it, it makes you cringe and every last hair on your body is just standing on end. You're just like, ah, man. So I wanna let you guys know what are some of my pet peeves. Now, obviously people who are ill-mannered or disrespectful or rude, those, you know, those people get on my nerves too. They bother me too. I hate them too, just as much as you do. But I'm assuming that most people do. So that's not really like something unique to me that bothers me. Uh, I want to share with you guys the things that bother me that might not bother other people. I hope this isn't an excuse for somebody who's watching to come up to me and to do these things because I will punch you in the face. No questions asked. So first, what really bothers me is when people walk and they shuffle their feet. And when I see people do it, I feel like that person is lazy and they don't have their life together and they probably eat puppies for breakfast or something bad like that. But seriously, why can't you pick up your feet? It's easy, you just, you just pick it up all the way and move forward and then you do the same thing. and you look like a decent human being and not a child learning to walk. So please, just pick up your feet and I won't have to stab you. I really cannot stand it when I'm eating and I'm eating something that is maybe a little bit out of the ordinary, but it's not out of the ordinary, it's just something that's different to other people. And I'm eating something and while I'm eating it, they, they say mean things. Uh -huh. Oh, dude, what are you eating? Oh, it looks so gross. Oh, it smells. Oh. <laughs> Why would you do that? Why? As I'm eating it, you are saying things like, it's gross. How could you eat that? That is nasty. Oh, you're weird. And I kind of have like a little episode about that. Pretty much what I just showed you happened to me back in elementary school. I took some sticky rice, my mom's baked chicken that's baked in like oyster sauce and ginger and a little bit of honey, which is pretty freaking amazing. And I also took some tamakung or som tam, which is spicy papaya salad. And there's some fish sauce in there. You know, some of that badak, if you know what I'm talking about. It's like fermented fish. I know, it smells, it's gonna smell, fish smells anyways, and then you're gonna ferment it. It's gonna smell pretty bad. I get it. I was like in elementary school in the third or fourth grade and I brought those with me and I brought my rice in like the the Laos rice basket thing. Uh, it's called Gatip Kao. And I brought it in that with my baked chicken and tamahung, the spicy papaya salad. That minute I brought out the rice basket and opened up the spicy papaya salad, man, did I get some looks from my Peers, they were just like, oh, what is that smell? Oh, it smells so bad. Oh, it smells like somebody farted. What is that? Oh, eh. you know, kids are pretty honest and brutal when they don't know they're being like mean or rude, but they kept egging on as I was eating it and just saying those things. After that, I never brought food from home that wasn't like a sandwich or some fruit roll ups and a bag of potato chips, you know? But I never over that, I guess. Kind of sad. To this day, I'll eat kimchi or something, which is a pretty strong smell. And when people see me eating it, oh, it smells so bad. I don't know how you can eat this. Gross. I'm gonna eat this. This is my meal. And you're gonna talk shit about it? That's not okay. Now, I know there's other problems in the world, you know, like real problems, but I just wanted to let you guys know some of the things that bother me. I don't know if this is a good idea. Anyways guys, that's it for this video. I definitely have a lot more pet peeves, but I feel like if I tell you all of them, this video could go on for days. 
So we will just go with those two for now. And as I get older, I'm sure I will find more things that bother me. So what is something unique or different that bothers you that might not bother other people? Leave them in the comments below. I'd like to know what weird things bother you. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit the thumbs up button. And if you want to see more of my videos, check out my channel and subscribe. All right, guys, that's it for this video. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Who needs friends when you have food? You're probably thinking, why not have friends and food? And I say no, because they're just gonna eat your food. So just food. Meh.